myself Nidra Soni and I am talking on behalf of all the members of the group Reducing the Use of Plastic Waste. We have selected the topic Chatur Chimpanzees. The problems which we have identified are that excess amount of plastic is being used, unnecessary plastic is also being used and, no, and mostly non-degradable plastics are being used which harms the environment. And the solutions which we have came up with are that we are always carrying paper bags or cloth bags with us wherever we go to reduce the um, to reduce the amount of plastic used by the people and not bringing unnecessary plastic at home another is that we always that we do not use unnecessary plastic or we do not use the plastic unless it is necessary and the objective of our survey is to make this world a better place and reduce the usage of plastic one day or another for our future generation good morning students good morning, good morning. Good morning. So students, today we have a guest. Her name is Niharika Singh. She is from a big organization called Reduce and Reuse Plastic Waste. She is here in our school to spread knowledge about it. Ma'am, why are the organizers here? Hey, are you stupid? Don't ask my questions. Sorry, ma'am. Good morning, students. Myself, Niharika Singh. And I am from an organization which helps the world to get better. Is this the first time you are coming to a place where you are organizing? No, I have been to various different places schools, functions, and educational sites to promote my ideas to people. I have went to big cities in all over India to spread knowledge about these things. But now I have set up my mind to come to small villages in India to spread these little things knowledge which will create a havoc in the future. What is your aim for the organization? The aim of the organization reducing the use of plastic waste is to make this earth a better planet to live on. So children, tell me. What do you know about plastic pollution? Yes, plastic pollution is a disease which cannot be cured. Plastic pollution is the accumulation of plastic waste in the environment which negatively affects the habitat and living things. It also harms the ecosystem. And what are the causes of plastic pollution? The excess usage of plastic. And what happens with the plastic pollution? The aquatic life is getting harmed due to this. Domestic animals eat plastic which harms the body and eventually kills them. Soil erosion also occurs due to plastic pollution. Plastic is not degradable. Our organization has come up with bucket full of ideas of, and solutions of these problems. That are, we should use as least amount of plastic as possible. We should always carry a paper bag or cloth bag along with us to use, to use them and not bring any unnecessary plastic at home. We should always use biodegradable plastic and we should try to store the vegetables in cloth bags rather than keeping them in the plastic bags. Hey, listen carefully now, you need to apply this in your mind. All the side effects of plastic pollution are that it affects our environment, the breathing system of humans as well as animals, and also sometimes causes lung diseases. So guys, tell me, what do you follow at home for controlling the usage of plastic? And tell the truth, huh? No nonsense. Yes? I advise my family members not to cut plastic packages in regular shape. I will use plastic bags for storing things. Wait, living all this apart, what are your achievements in your organization? Let me answer. Our organization has collected plastic pens from schools and we have given them to DIDC for recycling bin. Our organization also has an Insta page in which we upload pictures for spreading knowledge. Also, there are many homes including our own which follow the rules of controlling the plastic usage. Oh wow, that's, that's interesting. interesting. Thank you all for giving me your precious time for sharing, for me to share the demerits and the causes of plastic pollution. Thank you for coming here and telling your information. I hope you will all apply this in your life.